Hello, I'm Mike Huber. I'm the uh, Corporate Remediation Manager for Axial Corporation here in Lake Charles. And we want to just make the public aware of a project that we're going to have that's going to be starting up in about two weeks. On February 23rd is the current date that we expect it to start. And what the public will see as they pass over the I-210 bridge here in Lake Charles is a dredging activity. We're going to, be, we're going to have a boat out in Bayou Den area uh, and in the areas, other areas around the plant, they'll see a dredge. Just like you see coming up and down the ship channel, the port dredges the ship channel constantly. We're going to be doing some dredging in the vicinity of the 210 bridge uh, starting in a couple of weeks or so. And what the public will see when that happens is they will see the, the material that, that dredged out of Bayou Den and other areas is removed with water and the water is transferred through a pipeline and the pipeline could be a mile long or so and it'll be emptied into the area directly underneath the 210 bridge. Um, and when it comes out of the end of the pipe, it kind of like a, somewhat like a geyser. And because the mud is, is dark, black mud, it could give the public the impression that there's a rupture of a pipeline out in the marsh area. But we just want to assure you this is all planned. There's no danger to the public. It's a routine thing. In fact, uh, what I would like to draw the public's attention to is that this is exactly what coastal restoration is all about in Louisiana. It normally happens out in the middle of nowhere and nobody can see it happening. We're going to actually be pumping sediment into this marsh area here and planting some wetlands on part of it. We'll see, you'll see wetlands created right here underneath the 210 bridge. We think that's a very positive thing. The wetlands, of course, are great for the, the fish and the shrimp and the crabs and the ducks and geese, etc. So we think it's a real good project, but we just want to assure the public it's planned. This could be happening 24 hours a day, so you could see lights, things going on out here in the middle of the night. But uh, it's all something that's been approved by the Corps of Engineers, the DEQ and the EPA. Uh, it'll start, it'll probably be going on for most of the year, maybe into the September time frame. So just want to make the public aware of that. If you have any questions, feel free to contact me out at Axial, Mike Huber.